you know, you came off your trip from Germany. Um, what was that? Thursday till what was that Tuesday? Monday. Monday. Mm-hmm. Thursday till Monday. Uh, tell us about that. Give us some highlights, man. You know. So it was my motorcycle clubs Euro Nights twentieth anniversary. Okay. Um, kind of a big deal, man. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a it's a motorcycle club that myself and two other people started twenty years ago, being young and just going out there getting after it mm-hmm. and just to see where the club is right now that particular chapter right now and all the work we put in mm. um it gave me energy especially going over there seeing the camaraderie seeing the families um seeing the brotherhood and then you know seeing something that i actually put my hands on touch and influence so many people um it, it's it's emotional, if anything else, okay. just to see something that you've built and have the staying power and to see other people enjoying it, um, if not as much more than what you enjoyed it when you were there. So it gives me energy and it definitely helps me push forward, especially starting another organization, Black Lion, obviously, mm. and seeing that and seeing what Black Lion could be 20 years from now. Um, and all of them, both Black Lion and the Euro Knights both have something in common and that's helping people so Mm -hmm. it was a good time gave me energy okay so um what was the highlight from that from that trip you know what was it like a day you know oh my gosh i remember this for a lifetime you know nah so the biggest highlight is we had envisioned creating an organization based upon our value sets right Mm -hmm. we want to be able to make sure that our friends and family could come around and not be judged and make sure everybody has a safe place so we had the party and at the beginning of uh, the party, um, we had family members come around and just seeing how comfortable and how relaxed. It was almost like a day at the park and seeing uh-huh. how relaxed everybody was. We had a live band playing and little girls just running around, just standing there watching the band play. And I didn't really get a sense that anybody was missing their kids. It was just like yeah. that child was everybody's child because everybody was watching to make sure the child was okay. And just to see her innocence running around there having fun and to see everybody not really um, super concerned, like, where's my child at? Where's my child at? Yeah. And to see that everybody was really watching out for the child to make sure the child was all right. Mm. That that would, actually, out of everything that happened this weekend, was probably my biggest highlight. Because, again, it just brought the values of what we, what we encompassed. Mm. And just to see that 20 years later is awesome. Okay. So, like, are you proud of, like, what the... What, what the 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 motorcycle club has become 20 years later yeah absolutely i mean every organization is gonna has ebbs and flows and you know i am proud to say if i had to talk to 20 year old me or 20 something year old me about what the organization will look like later Mm. right if i had the opportunity right now at 48 to go back and talk to 28 year old carrie and say is it worth it i would tell tell 28 year old carrie it was definitely worth it and keep pushing 